Welcome back to EKG. Back here today with God of War. Okay, so me and Eric have been talking. <laughs> and, um, yeah, so it turns out... Oh, I should let her talk first. Nope, are you done? Actually, we might have seen this. She showed us the world tree last time, but... Approach the table. Yeah, yeah I'm How trying. Does work? How does you it work? This, a bifrost, to create yeah, I think we did. But anyway, lives. so, uh, my it roommate capture, is in a very interesting relationship situation. <laughs> so, he's with this Place girl. Bifrost, She's yeah. awesome. Like, probably a little too good looking for him, but, like, also, <laughs> like, like, at a boy like you know like sometimes you see something like give it a roommate's not an ugly dude the but this girl's like mm, she's really really sleep. fucking hot yeah it is from this but room he's a cool dude this she's a cool chick all the power tool point is between realms. so they're basically like together together and they like really like each other type what you like, see like, before you represent some the like, it was some a little serious <laughs> as well as the realm she powers that encircle the lake of nine is married <laughs> And has All three kids. Exist in the same and physical space, not only is she married, she also she also used to be best friends with Sean's ex-wife. Yeah, that's that, that's that's a new addition. And yeah. Um, on the branches she's also had sex tree, with his ex-wife. Oh. Only by the and light of she married this a place cuck. Can focus and that <laughs> the dude just can't get enough of her. Get another. Only get enough. You know what I mean? No, and um, is much, what are you talking about? It's just a, such an interesting situation. Like, an Eric was asking, the What's the mindset of a cock? Yeah, what's the psychology of that? Like, like I gotta give you my theory. What's yours? Like, I mean, I I don't really have a concrete theory. The, my, the best, like, logic I can think of that is that, like, it's, you know, similar to the people who are into, like, BDSM, just, like, being humiliated. Like, that's a turn on to them. I guess. Yeah. And, like, and that. And that and stems from a whole thing of like every strand it basically time, stems from space. a survival every mechanism where like if you grew up getting nothing but like so, constant like negative reinforcement and humiliation from your you pretty if you're a dude from your mom or if you're a girl from your yes. dad then like well. your brain pretty much forces you to you correlate to switch correlation from humiliation to, to like pain Instead, to like pleasure and it's just like oh <laughs> Is that why? I... Wait, is this moving the big bridge outside? So here's the thing. Yes. Um, the wheel we turns talking, the bridge, like, and the and bridge is to the For all our male viewers, <laughs> could outside. you cuck somebody? What? Could you no fuck a girl and in front of her man? Eric's like, I don't know, I'd try. Like, like, I would try, but I feel like it'd be into. weird. Like, the after a while, I'd just be like, again. okay, I get the gist, dude. Every you can go. <laughs> you can leave. Like, I'm gonna stay here. I'm gonna stay here. Yeah, I, it, I don't now know. It's just, I just feel like it'd be really awkward. Kratos would cuck the shit out of someone. Are you kidding me? Oh yeah. Look, look at that man. And see, and that's the thing. I would do. I would look dude straight in the <laughs> goddamn eyes as I finish. Yeah, but what if he's? What if like after you started looking at him, he started like really going at himself, like just jerking it. Oh, I would probably like, look yeah. away and flip him off. Yeah. Be like. I'd be like, oh, you see that. That's where I feel like it'd get the weirdest for me. It's like just watching the dude like getting off, like watching me. See, my hope is that by the time like we're getting to the the end of it, he's hit that moment where he realizes he's made a mistake, <laughs> and that's when I look him in the eyes. And you just see the ultimate regret. Yeah. As he realizes, not only did he make a mistake because he has to, he's sitting here watching the woman he loves get. Absolutely, just fucking fucked like a little, like a little ammo. <laughs> he's got to understand that he's never gonna be able to do that himself. So. Yeah. Yeah, it seems pretty emasculating. Yeah. So but again, I know a lot of people are into that. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm uh, <clears throat> I would gladly There's be a cucky. No until it's replenished with a gladly. Gladly. I mean, if it came at this point, if it came down to like the girl being like, "Yeah, so you can fuck me, but it has to be in front of my boyfriend," I'd be like, "Yes, ma'am." Well, yeah, it depends on how she is. Like, <laughs> oh, yeah. you're like, oh, oh, god, yeah. You're like, well, I gotta take one for the team. Yeah, like if I'm on the fence, like, eh, I mean, she's okay, but I don't really know. And then like that, would yeah, be then I'm like, no. I'd be like, yeah, I'll pass. But yeah, if she was just a smoke show, I'd be like, oh, I will fuck you in front of anyone you want me to fuck. It's the live studio audience. Let's go. <laughs> Insert the cross, like, woo. 
Welcome <laughs> you to start, like, time, like, oh, oh, wait, I need to take a break. Oh, what is that, the, the Rick and Morty where Alive. Rick's, like, on the planet with his ex-girlfriend who, like, she can control, like, populations as, like, See a hive mind? She the is the hive mind. Yeah, and she, like, and he's like, all right, I want you to fill a football there. stadium all with people who look like my dad chanting my name as I as I uh, skydive into the arena to go swoop into you. <laughs> Whoa. To restore the Bifrost magic, you must oh, yeah. step into the light. But be very careful not to get she has like uh they don't entirely explain it right now but basically zeus put a like curse on her that She's like she dead. can never leave midgard where like she can't teleport to the, any of the other realms without being like torn um, back huh oh yeah god of war is happening right now yep <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while and not a while but it's been a while it's, it's been a while since i've played this game personally because i I'd, I'd beaten nothing. the main story um okay. not too long ago like uh, a month that? or two and I was, try I was doing some of the challenges, and then I got to one on, like, the I hell planet. Or not the hell, but, like, the fire planet, where um, the, one of the last challenges, you have to beat 100 enemies in, like, a single trial, and I was just getting Whoa. absolutely raged. <laughs> not I got down to, like, boy. nine enemies Focus. left after, like, legit 30-plus minutes going nonstop in just that one sequence, and then I died, and I was like, nope, done. <laughs> I wish I could have seen that. Yeah, no, it was I'm fun. done. I'm done. Paul I'm saw it. <laughs> Paul, let me know how it was. It was, it was a fun time. Yeah, no. So to uh, summarize, I would cut the shit out of anybody, and I would. Oh. Good amount of people that I would just uh. One. That I would do it. One more. Yeah. But no, would I ever be the cock? No, God no. <laughs> yeah, I I can't. That sounds like torture to me. Like it's the right? opposite of what I want. So. Yeah, like uh, I just I'll never wrap my head around that. Yeah, my roommate is dating a girl who's married to me. That's such an interesting situation, though. It's just like, it just shows that, like, you really should be careful about, like, who you marry, who you have, like, kids with and stuff. Because, like, you never know. <laughs> she doesn't love the dude anymore, but has to stay with them because the kids. Man, I, I'm going to have to refresh myself on these controls. Right. Yeah, so that's, uh, that's that story. <laughs> Make sure... Blah, blah, blah. You don't become a cock. <laughs> that was a beautiful song. Oh boy, let's the fuck out. I just can't believe people are getting married and having kids. I know it's fucking weird. Like I already know people who have been divorced. Right? I live with somebody who's been divorced, <laughs> and he's a year older than me. Yeah, that's insane. And I'm just over here like, yeah, and I. Uh... I haven't dated anyone in five years. Yeah, I haven't like seriously dated anyone in so long. Yeah, I'm not. I'm really not complaining about that. Oh yeah, no, because like I'm not in a rush. No, not at all. I think the people who are in a rush are the people who get in trouble. Yeah, like, those are the people that fucking marry someone they're not totally sure about, and then a few years later it's like, well, fuck. What are they attacking? Yeah, financially I can't not be here. I'm trapped. <laughs> yeah. And being trapped is literally the worst thing that could happen. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna go go ahead and pass on that one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, I'm pretty sure the last thing I want right now is, like, a kid. My God. Oh, my God. Yeah, no. I can barely take can care of myself something? financially. I'm going to no. go ahead and skip that one. Yeah. Okay. Because, like, fuck it. Everyone I talk to that as kids, like, they're just like, oh, yeah, I wish I could do this, but I don't have the money. It's like, oh, because I have to I spend all this money on my kid. It's no, like, it's like, yeah, they have to work, like, two or three jobs just to be able to, like, live. Yep. And it's like, ew. Yeah, I'm not trying to do that. I work for maybe yeah, five days a week so and I'm comfortable. Yeah. And I work like between like six to eight hour shifts. Wait. Sometimes five. Me? Man, I hate you. <laughs> Bartending dude, it's it's risky begin? because like my income is solely yeah, based on fluctuates. Yeah. But like mine's kinda like that, but like but it's I'm actually in a nice spot where like even if I don't get a lot of overtime, I'll still make enough to like be good. Yeah. So then any overtime I have is really just kind of a bonus. Yeah. But you spend all your money on goddamn weed. No. <laughs> More than I should, I'll admit that. That's it. That's one of the reasons I stopped smoking. I was, it wasn't because I don't like, like it. Like I don't like getting You're fucking wrong. high. Yeah. It's money. That's why I don't smoke cigarettes because I, like everyone around me smoked when I was a kid, but I was just like. Dude, it costs money. Yeah, ne never do. I like I, I'm getting close to the point where Look, like I want to quit solely for the financial aspect of it. Yeah, it just it costs a lot of money. Yeah, like, dude, like, it's it's not back in the day where like cigarette packs were like fifty cents. Yeah, like, fucking like eight bucks now. Yeah, that's the thing. 
three cigarette packs cost as much as a handle of Captain Morgan. And the yep. handle of Captain Morgan is going to last me longer than your three cigarette packs. Oh, yeah. Like, that's the thing. Like, yeah, I drink. But I don't, like... I'm not one of those people like if I don't not, have a bottle not at home, bag. I'm not like sweating. Oh, yeah. Like I just like if I have a bottle, I'm like cool. Like last night I had okay. a drink. Yeah. It was like a it was a Friday, a little long day after work. I'm like, yeah, I want a fucking drink. Fuck yeah. Oh yeah. Nothing wrong with that. Yeah, but man, some I some vices just cost too Video much. Mother, speak yep. this realm. But I know I wish it would just get fucking much. legalized already so it wouldn't be so goddamn expensive. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Although I will say I'm at the point where the I've made a solid enough like couple connections where like I'm not spending nearly as much as I used to because I actually get like decent deals now. Nice. You got you got those links to the underground. Right. Yeah. I'm such a badass. Right. <laughs> and on that note, go ahead and. Uh, well, do, well, do you feel like we've done enough this episode? Nothing. I know we've done a lot of talking, but uh, let's get to the end of the boat ride. Yeah, let's, yeah, let's, yeah. Let's finish up. What is it, boy? See, oh, I, I always like contest when you'll go be like, oh, is it time for next time? I'm like, no. <laughs> usually, if I go like, oh, enjoy next time, you're like, okay. <laughs> Well, then something's happening too, so we'll let this play out. It was screaming. He's got voices in his head. This is the start to one of those Atreus. <laughs> uh, Kratos from 34. Thanks. Oh, no. no. <laughs> Look at the way he's looking at him. He's like, oh, right? Oh, that, my. Like, that pouty lip. <gasps> I wish my beard grew in that full. Christ. I know, right? If, if I trimmed it like, a, like regularly and like kept it shaped, I could maybe get it like that. Well,. The problem is, is the chin for me. Like the, but to the bottom of the lip. Yeah, doesn't connect. So like, no, it's like. Look, we no fill in. Them? Yeah, there's no fill the, in there. Th that comes. I, I used to have that too. Like, and mine still do doesn't like fill in all so the way fully, but like us. it, it'll get there over time. Do you shave us. ever like fully? Cause I have, I haven't fully shaved in like. Not the main years. beard part, but like around here and like here and shit. I will. Okay. Like around my mouth. So otherwise, like, a lot of times my mustache hairs will get too long, and then when I, like, eat or drink, I'll, like, be, like, swallowing mustache Dude, hairs. Dude, so I let my barber, uh, take care of my beard usually, and I... Same. He didn't touch up my mustache once, and, like, it was to the point where, like, I would, like, kiss a girl. It would just be all mustache. I'm yep. like, I'm so sorry! Give him, give him those mustache rides. Yeah. <laughs> uh, anyway. <laughs> Join us next time. Join us next time. Jesus. For more mustache rides. For cuck... Mustache ride with <laughs> while high. There, that that's everything summed that's, up in a sentence. That's the episode. Wow.